I think the project is uh, definitely uh, on the very, very top level of quantum physics. It tests uh, quantum physics in a regime where it was never tested before. It's also technologically at an extremely high level. And it's also, I think it's an also important project to, you know, bridge the gap between continents, bridge the gap between cultures. I think that's an, and between political systems, I think that's a very important, also a very important sign out to the, to the other communities. From the physics point of view, I think the project is, is very interesting. Uh, nobody ever tested quantum mechanics at these large scales. For the uh, information technology, it's uh, very important because secure message is uh, important not only in defense and government reasons, but also finance in uh, and to protect intellectual properties. So, um, so uh, the uh, the secure communication is important in all uh, parts of our society. I'm really happy that China is so so much investing into into science at uh, and that this investment started at, at a very early stage of, of rapid economical. Uh, development and so uh, now China is uh, let's say uh, it, it is becoming uh, let's say an, uh, a, a very important let's say player in the field of, of science uh, to be honest to, to my phrase is that kind of China is returning to its uh, old place in the history in the in the in, let's say in, in the global in influence of the world it was a superpower 2,000 years ago, and it's, it's becoming a superpower nowadays, and also superpower in, in, in science. So I'm, I'm this rapid development is really, really fantastic. And one of the fruits is, is this, this experiment.